Well, I started playing football as a seven-year-old kid uh, back in Virginia. That's where I'm from. Uh, my town is very, very small. It's similar to uh, the, the Friday Night Lights movie, football movie. Uh, you know, 4,500 people. Football is just a way of life. So uh, that's where I actually grew up, and that's how I started playing football. Uh, I ended up getting a football scholarship to the University of Virginia, played there for four years. Um, and then I was drafted in 2000 in the uh, NFL draft. I was the seventh pick overall in the draft. Uh, I was drafted by the Arizona Cardinals. Uh, from there, I was traded to the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, uh, signed a four-year deal with the Chicago, Chicago Bears, was traded after the Super Bowl in 2007 to the New York Jets, played there for three years, was released, uh, signed a two-year deal with the Kansas City Chiefs, and, uh, and now I'm one year uh, out of the NFL. So, uh, you know, I played 12 years of NFL football, four years of major college football, four years of high school football, and uh, pretty much that's pretty much from my life. Uh, you know, being an NFL player is very, uh, it's very exciting, it has its, you know, its positives and its, its negatives. Um, but, you know, there's definitely a lot of positives. You know, I played in some really, really good cities. Uh, I played in Phoenix, which is a great city. I played in Tampa Bay, um, you know, which is a great city. I played in Chicago, which is, you know, huge. And I played in New York City. Um, and also in Kansas City, which is, you know, in the middle of the country. Um, so, you know, I've, I've, I was blessed enough to play in a wide variety of cities and get to, to enjoy um, a lot of experiences from each, each part of the country, each region. And, um, you know, I, I would definitely have to say, you know, playing in New York City was probably the most glamorous, uh, you know, place that I played just because, you know, it's, it's New York, it's a city of bright lights, uh, you know, um, you know you, you, you're a recognized figure. So, you know, if you go to a restaurant downtown, um, you know, if you've had a good game, you know, you get a standing ovation. Uh, if you have a bad game, you don't get a standing ovation. But, uh, you know, I mean, there's a lot of perks to it. You know, you work every day pretty much, um, you know, as far as practice and film, film study and training, which is, you know, it's, it's, it's pretty grueling on you as far as, you know, your, your, your physical, um, you know, issues that come with that and also mental issues. You know, you have to be really, really tough to play in the NFL for um, a year, let alone, you know, 12 years. Um, but, you know, like I said, you know, the, the payoff is huge, you know, if you're able to be successful because there's a lot of perks to come with it. The negative side of the NFL is, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's hard to explain. Um, physically, it's tough on you. Um, it's a very, very brutal game. It's a very violent game. Uh, a lot, you have a lot of injuries, and, um, but you have to have the mentality of, of if I can walk, I can play. Uh, so you may have um, an injury that someone that doesn't play in the NFL would have, and, and they may be out of work for two weeks. Um, we don't have two weeks because we have a game every week, every Sunday. Um, sometimes, you know, the week's cut short if you have a Thursday night game, so you only have a couple of days to recover. Um, and then some days you may have a Monday night game, so you have maybe one extra day. So, um, but, you know, in all, you know, you have a maximum of seven, you know, to eight days to recover, to be ready to go and, and play again at a high level. Um, with that comes pressure because if you can't play at a high level because of injuries, there's always someone else there to take your spot. So that's where, you know, the mental toughness comes in and the emotional issues that come with being an NFL player. Um, there's so many aspects to it, um, you know, besides just um, what people see on TV.